Hey folks, Father Sampathik from CG Vitus here. So our colleague in our studio asked about uh, film grain uh, note for Blender Compositor. So we have done it here. Uh, you can download it from here. Okay. So let me demo some stuff uh, how uh, it's looking. So first of all, let's go to F4 and append our Blender Compositor disk cache scene here. And uh, let's go to the comp one. Let's go to comp one. There we go. And uh, let's grab uh, some VLC. Here we go. VLC. And uh, the frame is 24x uh, 15 seconds. Here we go. So if I go here, you can see it here. Okay. So we're using MKV. So yeah, somewhere here. Okay, so it should be 1920, and other things are fine. So let's get it started. Ju it's a very simple, um, uh, 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 you know, uh, note <coughs> setup here. So let's see how to use it. So after downloading and uh, downloading it, extract the zip file, and you will find this film gain dot blend here. Okay, and uh, what you need to do is basically you need to append it. Press F4 and append. And uh, let's go to desktop, and this is the film grain blend. So I'm just going to go in here, and there is a node tree, and you will find this film grain. Okay, so let's import it here. Press Shift A, search, and uh, film grain, film grain. Okay, so how does it look, uh, and how to use it is pretty simple. Just go Shift A, and go to the mix, uh, mix node, and uh, let's connect it here, and let's connect it here okay so you will see that there is your film grain uh, i will show you the making of as well so not to worry and uh, in mix note traditionally what we do is basically we use overlay uh, for this so you can see the film grain okay and uh, we can use some factor something like um something like 0.2 something so it will give you the you know the film quality green actually so yeah or uh, you can use also you can use another one that is called add you can use add here uh, which will give you so much more room to play with so uh, suppose I go for 0 0.02 or 1 or something like that you can see uh, I'm not sure if it's uh, showing here but you can see it here as well so let's go somewhere here. Yeah. So point two. You can see the film grain here. Okay. Or you can use also you can use dodge for this. Yeah, dodge is also a very cool uh grain setup. You can see this grain here. If I disable it, you can see the grain. Okay. So uh you can use overlay, you can use add or you can use dodge. So overlay is uh, pretty much a standard when it comes to stock. So stock green setup. So 0.5. Okay. So uh, let's see a demo. Um, yeah, let's see some demo. So let's go for P and let's here under shift i I'm going to save it untitled. Yep. And uh, let's do. Let's do it. Okay. So here is the cache. Okay, uh, let me zoom it in. Control space, and I'm uh, uh, I'm using you know uh, point 0.5 here to uh, uh, give you the look here. Okay, quite obviously it should be point 0.2 or point 0.1 something. So here is the grain. Okay, you can see the grain level here. Okay, okay. So this is a uh, color green. Okay. Uh, if we zoom in, you can see this is the color green. So if you want to use, um, let's use Shift to create this. Yeah. If you want to use uh, black and white, you can use BW, RGB to BW. So it will create a black and white uh, noise for you. Okay. So, uh, oh, sorry, not this one. It should be here. Film green. Yeah. Let me go here, BW, RGB to BW. There you go. Okay. 
so if we go here you can see that this is black and white and uh, this is color okay so that's how you can work with it so now let's uh, see how to uh, make off uh, you know uh, how to make this thing okay uh, so for those people who don't want to see it uh, you can uh, you know uh, leave the video not problem and uh, if you want to see how to make this thing uh, stay let's see all right so to make this stuff we're going to use a texture node here so let's go here and uh, let's go to the texture node editor and uh, yeah let's go to brush as well uh, you can see that we don't have any texture node here because we are in comp1 from appended scenario uh, so what you can do is basically go to the layout and uh, go to the texture paint okay just enable it and you will see the texture tab has appeared again so let's go to the layout and let's go to compositing custom again so here we go uh, we're going to use brush going to use a new and uh, going for um, nice there we go and now we're going to use use notes here and now we're going to use note <coughs> for noise editing so we are in texture node editor okay so let's delete everything uh, first let's create some noise this one and uh, this one is uh, go for this and uh, go to the R and uh, let's turn R uh, shift D uh, this one should be yep this one one okay and this one should be green zero and other things are fine and uh, shift D and let's go for blue oops yeah blue blue one so uh, pretty simple just go for shift A search mix mix RGB go for add check clamp color just I know go here here so this is the factor go for factor one and now let's go press shift D I usually don't do node stuff in uh, tutorial mode because it's so much boring anyway so let's do it like that and let's do it like that so this is at okay everything is done so what you can do you can see it here shift a search and uh, we can go for our texture texture note here we go and uh, we can go for texture yeah okay so I'm going to name it uh, my green or something yeah so if you want to see it you can press uh, color but we haven't input it anything here so here we go so you can see it from here so what we need to do is basically now we are going for our subtract mode so I'm just going to shift D and uh, we're going for our subtract subtract and just put it here okay so here we go now you can see your stuff okay all right so uh -huh. this one this one 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 hsv we don't need value so this is the value so what we are doing here essentially so your uh, noise is ready so what we are doing essentially is basically we are just mixing rgb in a way that uh, it will give us an add then we are uh, using uh, red and green to add then red green and blue to add so that means why we're using clamp because we don't want to override this white because you can see this white is one and then one plus one equal to it will be two and uh, two plus one equal to three so this is and so that's why we're using clamp to uh, you know mean and max zero to one zero to one value and why we are using a subtract we are going to use subtract because if we don't use it you will see this okay so white 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 everything is white so now we are going to subtract white from other values that means this will give you black okay these are the black okay so if I want to increase it or decrease it yeah Jesus okay <laughs> so that's why um, as it's a random noise so uh, we can uh, actually set things up here yeah. so yeah so this is how we can do it so uh, this is it actually essentially so what we need to do is basically now we're going for a gamut correction so that means syn linear space it is not in syn linear so what we're going to do here is basically 
we're going to create a gamma and let's try a math note okay and we're going to divide it why we're doing it because we need a thin linear noise not a uh, color management noise color managed noise so yeah uh, so the divide should be 1 divided by 2.2 .2. yeah and uh, yep and then let's just connect it here so now it is gamma corrected and uh, everything is fine for your noise so that's it uh, now you can see press shift a mix here we go mix and if we want to see it here in image you can see it in here as well actually it will be swapped there we go and uh, yep as usual overlay there we go simple and we can use 0.5 here as well so now let's how to uh, let's see how to pack it uh, well to pack it what you need to do is basically just avoid all of this setup uh, we just need these three yep this this and this press ctrl G to group it go to the group go to the note change the name to color conventional so here we go and just name it like migraine okay so this is migraine <laughs> migraine okay so uh, yeah that's it yeah all right so that's it um, our studio has given me some uh, you know a, a list of things a list of compositing notes so most probably um, by this month or in the next month uh, this will be populated with some more notes so you can check it out by the way these are MIT license so that means you can develop it furthermore you can use in your studio not a problem okay everything is fine yep thank you I'm father Sampathik from CG virus and we're going to see you next time bye bye